Hey there, I'm Kimberly from 37 Signals, and today I wanna to show you several ways Basecamp can give you a big picture view into everything that's happening across your account. Maybe you manage a team that's working on multiple projects at the same time, or maybe you're working on multiple projects yourself and need a better way to get a handle on all the activity that's happening. There are several ways that Basecamp can help you do that, so let's jump right in. It's often helpful to see when one project ends and another one begins, especially if you're planning out your team's workload. Click on lineup for a bird's eye view of project timing. You'll see what projects just wrapped up, what's currently in progress, and what's coming up in the future. The vertical green line marks today, and clicking the buttons at the top moves you forward or backward in time. For projects to show up on the lineup, they'll need to have a designated start and end date. Click the three dot menu at the top of your project page and go to edit project details. Adding start and end dates to a project will display a tracker at the top of the project. And just like on the lineup, the green line represents today, letting you easily see where you are in the project timing. With dates added to the project, it now appears on the lineup. The lineup becomes even more helpful for planning when you use markers to highlight significant company-wide dates or milestones. Account owners and admins will see the Add Marker button at the top of the page. Give the marker a title and date, then save. Here at 37 Signals, we use markers to highlight our work cycles and cool-down periods, as well as company meetups, but you can use them to highlight any milestone or event that's date-specific. When you need to quickly see the overall status of a project, not just your to-do list, there's Move the Needle. From the top of the project page, you can see at a glance how far along a project is and see if it's on track, slightly at risk, or if there are bigger concerns. To make updates, click Move the Needle and slide it to a new position as the project reaches completion. Assign the needle a color to show how things are going and add notes to share additional details. A simple click just below the needle takes you to the full history where you'll see every move to the needle position, change in color, and notes all on one page. When the needle is updated regularly, you'll never be left wondering, how did we end up here? So Move the Needle gives you a quick, big picture view into a single project. When you want this view across multiple projects all at the same time, there's mission control. Under Activity in your navigation bar, click Mission Control to see all the needles for projects you're a part of in one place. Projects marked red for concerned or yellow for at risk stay at the top, so those troubled projects stay front and center. Clicking on any of the needles from Mission Control takes you to the full history so you can easily catch up on what's been going on. The Activity tab in your navigation bar shows activity across all your projects, but when you need to focus in on a handful of projects or wanna see what specific people are working on, you can filter that activity. From the top of the Activity tab, choose how you'd like to filter the report, either by projects or by people. Start typing what you're looking for, and when you're ready, hit Filter to get an abbreviated list of recent activity. Filtering by people works with individual names and with groups, so if you need to see what an entire team or department is working on, just enter that group name. Now, if you're using stacks on your home screen to group similar types of projects together, it's even easier to see the activity and progress for those projects. First, create a stack by dragging one project on top of another and giving your stack a name. Once your projects are stacked, just click on it and you'll see a link to see the activity for just those projects. And if Move the Needle is enabled for any of the projects within the stack, you'll also see a link to see the needles for just those projects in Mission Control. We hope these features help you better manage your projects for yourself and for your team. And as always, if you have questions as you're getting your Basecamp account set up, please reach out to our team at guides at basecamp.com. And thanks for watching.